So I can see from this point uh, one, two, three water features just from when I'm when I'm sitting here. So this is gonna be our fourth one. Uh, line up and just roll. Welcome to Heiner Outdoor Living. We're a team of yardists taking boring cookie cutter yards and transforming them into one of a kind backyard retreats. Join us as we bring quality, passion, and fun to yards all across the Colorado Front Range, inspiring life outside. Hey guys, this is Omar with Heiner Outdoor Living. We're starting a brand new project today and I uh, can't get tired of this view. Beautiful place to work. I love this place. We're going to be building a uh, pondless water feature. Our waterfall uh, scroll is going to start coming, start from this point. We're going to have a couple cascades. It's going to turn, it's going to pull up here and then it's going to, we're going to have like a little uh, meandering stream, shallow stream. Uh, up to 10 inches of water that it's going to meander all the way here. I'm going to have to rip out all this grass, move the sprinklers, lines and all that kind of stuff but we got probably 30 tons of rocks that we're going to be using here. It's not a small feature, it's, it's kind of long. That set of waterfalls is specifically for the uh, bedroom and this one is more for their uh, outdoor living area so this is going to look great. Now we're going to start uh, just uh, ripping up some of this existing landscaping and make it beautiful, baby. So we have a unique way to build this uh, uh, water feature in here. Um, well, we don't do it anywhere else, it's just in this specific neighborhood. So what we do is we have a double double bladder liner and we have our, our water, a liner that's gonna hold our water and we also have another liner underneath with gravel to uh, capture any water, any water that spills out of the pond, if there's a leak or something like that, uh, which is, it will not be. Um, so we have a way to capture all the water and that double bladder liner is gonna have a drain system underneath. This is a pondless system. This is where all our pumps are located. Uh, we're not gonna have a lot of water standing over here. Um, majority is gonna fall and disappear. This is where all the water is going to be uh, captured and sent back to both waterfalls. It's not just a, a normal water feature. It also has that, you know, the drain that it also takes a lot of time. So all this over here is hooked up to the up pipe right there, everything's just gonna be draining there. Whatever water that comes out of this uh, pond or even rain, you know, it's just gonna go straight to that um, sewer there. Engineering only allowed us to go 30 feet off the building with any kind of landscape and water. We've got a bunch of different uh, views from inside the house, so 
uh, one of the things I thought of was uh, splitting up the streams and having it be here more at the low point. It's gonna add a little bit of an extra, you know, interest to this backyard space. Uh, one thing that was also important to homeowners was they love their dogs, and so we wanted to maintain as much uh, grass in the foreground as, uh, as possible so they could play some fetch and use it to do what dogs do. But um, yeah, with that, and then this, the background, this is gonna be a nice little project in and out in a few weeks. Not, not a bad way to um, you know, enhance the view that they have, uh, that they have to look at. <laughs> boulders in place so um, it's looking really great and we have Matt here you know these aren't cookie cutter homes so I don't want a cookie cutter water feature so you know Omar and I were you know just collaborating just thinking thinking like what could we do a little bit different so uh, rather than just doing a big flat bridge piece uh, like we've done on on three of the other homes here let's let's come up with something that will still get you across uh, but be a little bit more of a unique experience so like some floating stepping stones or some stones that will be solid to walk across and be easy but then you just got water flowing through it and it still looks still looks natural and still does the job but still uh, doesn't break it up either. Nice. Nice. Stay tuned with this project because we're so close to the finish line. Uh, if you haven't done so, drop us a like or a comment and please hit the subscribe button so you don't miss another episode. Every Thursday about four o'clock mountain time, we drop a new episode. So we'll see you on the next one. Take care and happy holidays.